find a way to put it in the net. Shot down for an icing. They are overwhelmed, and I guess they thought that was the best thing. Rinkside we go now, and here is Ray Ferraro. Doc, there's been some changes over the last 10 years that maybe go under the radar, but have really changed the way the game's been played. Shifts used to be a minute long. Now 30 to 40 seconds is absolute max because the game is played at such high energy and maximum effort that you can't go any longer. Always appreciate hearing what's going on down there, Ray. Directing that one to Froli. The Flames continue to probe up the wing. Let's it go. That's a score! Didn't take long, did it? Calgary's ahead by one goal here in the first period. A lot of time still left to play, but getting one and breaking the tie was huge. Canucks look to make a difference up the wing. Wonderful chance was set up and the pass just goes wide. The Flames leave their own zone. Moved along and in. Looks ahead to start something. Wrist shot. Oh, what a break. That shot hit somebody. And the possession taken up by Bennett. With no time whatsoever, he turned it aside. A quick developing play right in front. Almost looks like he's too close to the goaltender. Got a piece of it with the glove. Under siege needs to be gotten out. Nice job, straight stand-up poke check. The Canucks carrying on in their own end. Snapping a pass to Gronlin. Superb defensive play by Brody. A questionable move at this point, shooting it down for an icing, but they've done it. Miller's athleticism was tested on that wrist shot. That was an excellent scoring chance. Just under nine minutes remaining in the period. The Flames lead 1-0. Grabbed the two centermen tied up, but there was a good reach there. Got the iron with the shot. Enormous hit. After a while, these rivals are just skating around in a circle. Finally, a big hit. Maybe that'll fire everybody up. Solid work there by Hutton. The Canucks on the move through center. To Dorset. Carried out of his own end towards center. On to Brody. Good move. And they've got it again. Gets across, looks over his options. Back near the blue line to Henrik Sedin. They can't find the target. Glides across. The shot is off. Great job on a cut pass. And he is reefed. That puck's loose. He couldn't get through the roadblock. Still no shot. Just wide of the post. That shot cannot miss the net. Give me that chance. I'll take it. The Flames organizing back in their own end. That's the way to make them pay. Laid on to Henrik Sedin. Stick handles right up the center. Nearing the last minute of play in the first. Oh, and he misses. He had enough room to unload the shot. He got all of it. He just missed one. Calgary's controlling play now and trying to get it going along the boards. The defense was in the way. Loose puck. Good jab with the stick there. First period is over. The players will get a rest. The vendors and the organist will not. The Flames are the only team to score, and they did it once. Eddie, we're about to enter the second period here. 
What did you think of the opening period of our game? Vancouver's lucky to still be in this game after the first period. They had turnover after turnover. I'm sure the coaches addressed that problem in the intermission. Oh, and it's off the mark. Point blast. Terrific challenge. Outstanding save. A missed opportunity from this close in. Out at the blue line. Loose puck blocked off by Henrik Sedin. Vancouver's moving it up the wing. Knocks it away with the stick. To Henrik Sedin. Makes that play deep. Gets in. What'll he do? That one blocked. Got a piece of it. Muscled long to Hamilton. It's tipped. Carried from the defensive zone towards center. And on the icing, play is stopped, and all the way back it will come for a faceoff. The Flames win it. Turn the wrist shot. Great save. Gets play stopped. Routine stop for the goaltender. The shooter's going to have to do a much better job challenging him. The Canucks with a face-off win. Pitching this one to Berchi. Solid neutralized poke check. Possession gained by Stone. Pitching it to Backlund. Moving it now up the wing. Puck settled down by Stone. Keeps it going up the wing. He's in. Vancouver's organizing back in the defensive zone. A shot. Oh, what a score! And the game is even. Get this close to the goaltender, the puck on your stick, you gotta snap it quick. Vancouver's got the game even up again. Still in the second period, lots of time. Can't wait to see what happens now. Vancouver goal, scored by number six, assisted by number 53. Gets in, looks over his options here. Fires, he caught it and he holds on. And he holds on. Might be something coming up here. He has been looking for this for a while. We have a winner, moving it to Versteeg. Oh, that's good. Many yards gained to Bartkowski. The Canucks with possession in the defensive zone. Into the attacking end. Good shooting place. Wow, what a glove save. Now that's a quick glove. Take it away. Got it right back. Good quick poke check there. Lugged ahead from the defensive zone. Turned right away with the poke check by Engelin. Making progress in the defensive zone. And possession seized by Engelin. Up the wing, he keeps on going. Gains the zone. Breakaway! And he missed the net. Not very often you get a golden opportunity like that, but you got to hit the net. Gives it over to the point. Let's a shot go. The Flames waiting back in the defensive zone. Looking to stage it. Jabbed away by Engelin. Trying to go to Giordano. Pass cut by the offense. Fantastic shutdown. They battle on up the wing. To Goudreau. have taken a late second period lead in this one. That might change the conversation in the locker room at the horn. 
Calgary has prevailed again on the faceoff in the neutral zone. He's in on an onside play. Hope checked away by Hamilton. To Giordano. Puck is thrown to Goudreau. Time of the goal. And he gains the zone. 45 seconds. Slid just inside the line to Stone. Last minute of play. Knocked right off the stick. He chipped that one off the boards and ahead. Good defensive play, hand to eye and center ice. There'll be time for the coaches to revise things between periods in a close, close game. Two periods, third period about to begin. The rear view mirror will help us with the first two, and so will Edson. Calgary's dominated in the scoring chances, Doc, through the first 40 minutes of play. They're only up by one here in the third. Let's see how they come out and start this period. Edler's tripped up. That should be a penalty. Calgary's got two on this one for tripping. There's always a start to your power play night, and this is number one. Strong play on that faceoff. You have to be strong to hold that other guy off. Nice standing poke check by Berchi. He retreats now, getting back to his own end. Chip to Froli. He gains the zone. Breakaway! He missed the net! Oh, he's gonna rue this one. You don't get many breakaways anymore in the game. He's got one, and he misses the net. Good clean win. One timer! Oh, that was close. The Canucks recoiling back in their own end. Snapped it off. Terrific save. Boy, he really had to battle through to see that screenshot. Carried toward the neutral zone. Gains the zone. Calgary's... They score! That's two unanswered goals! The Flames have struck for another goal. They've built a two-goal lead here early in the third period. All of hockey life is timing, and theirs is terrific. And he steps in. Could not be filtered through a strong play by Backlund. And picked up now by Stone. Keeps it going in their own end. Looking for options in neutral ice. Right in front. Terrific shot, but a great point blank save. Puck is grabbed by Backlund. Calgary's in their own end setting things up. Brody's in his own end headed toward center. Gains the zone and looks over his options. A shot. Wonderful save. He was hovering right over him. You want to score goals, you have to go to this area. Vancouver is carrying it up the wing. Henrik Sedin's hooked on the play. There will be a penalty. Calgary's roster goes down by one here. At least briefly, a minor penalty for hooking. The Canucks prevail again. Ooh, it lay there, but he got the whistle and stoppage of play. Just over seven minutes off the clock. Just recently, another goal, and so the lead is two. Calgary's got it back in their own zone. Turned a shot on net. In the defensive zone, still on the move. And he glides on to center ice. Long pass up the side to Boucher. Onside. Let's go a wrist shot. Skilled play by Engelin. Propel to Giordano. Oh, and he is drilled. I saw that play coming from a mile away. That one shot over half the length of the ice all the way down there, and it becomes an icing. Horvat's looking for some trouble here. Hurry up already. Drop your gloves. The Flames score! Oh.